Hey everyone, I'm Jamie from jamiedelainewatson.com. Today I'm going to be sharing how I prepare my clients for their engagement sessions and how you can do the same in your business. So the first step in this process is reaching out to the clients after booking and just touching base about when they would like their engagement session to be. The reason I suggest this is sometimes clients will book a year in advance, say they'll book in May for their wedding next July. Every client is different. Some would like engagement photos in the summer as well as their wedding photos in the summer. So we'll want to schedule their engagement session really shortly after booking. Other clients would like fall photos, winter photos, or to wait till the next spring. So by touching base with them, right away I can show them that I'm thinking about them, I'm thinking about every step of this process, and I'm also asking for what they want. So of course, if they do want an engagement session this summer, then we'll um, work together to put a date on the calendar, about eight weeks out usually. Now, if they want photos in the fall or the winter, we don't choose a date at this point because it seems kind of silly to choose a specific Wednesday afternoon, six months in advance. Instead, what I do is I put a note on my calendar about two months before the month that they want. And I just put a note in my Asana task list or on my calendar that says, get in touch with Ben and Leslie about their engagement session. And this way I can follow up with them before they ask me about it and show them once again that I am thinking of them. The next step in preparing your clients for their engagement session has to do with communication before the shoot. Over the years, I've put together an email template. And in this email template, I let couples know how to choose their outfits, how to coordinate their outfits. I let them know um, if they'd like to book professional hair and makeup for the bride, and that can be an amazing chance to do the makeup trial before the wedding day. And the other thing I let them know is that this is supposed to be fun. I will lead them through everything they need to know um, about posing, that nobody shows up knowing how to do this, and so they have nothing to worry about. I like to set their nerves at ease before they even show up on the session. Because I know what it's like, even when I show up to a session that say we've hired a photographer, I still have a little bit of nerves and I know exactly what's gonna happen. So I can only imagine how my clients feel. So by addressing those fears right away, it hopefully sets them at ease a little bit and keeps those pre-shoot jitters down. I've kind of built this into my email template when it comes to choosing outfits. I suggest that clients check out my blog for visual examples of what um, other couples have chosen in the past. Not only is this for choosing outfits, but this also helps them um, be re-familiarized with my portfolio. Especially if, say, just the bride was coordinating the photo session, it helps the groom kind of see, okay, this is the work that she creates, we're going to trust her on the day of, and we're going to make great photos. So that's another great byproduct while also providing direction around their outfits. And with engagement sessions, I request that couples bring two outfits, one a bit more casual and one a bit more formal. And then we'll switch up about halfway through the session to give clients a totally different look. And now I recommend that couples coordinate but don't match. And I always say the most important thing is to coordinate the level of formality or casualness to the images. Another great tip that I give clients is I love bright, beautiful colors, but if one of you is in that, have the other person in neutral. And always kind of play up those two sides. So you're going to have neutrals with a pop of color, and that's going to make your photos awesome. And finally, on the day of the engagement session, I reiterate what I shared in the email template about how I'll direct them through all of the poses. Nobody shows up knowing what to do. They're not the first couple to have nerves and feel like they're not good in front of the camera. And it's my job to make them look beautiful and my job to lead them through all of the poses so they love their photos. So I laugh a lot, I talk a lot, I talk quite fast. I'm usually out of breath because I'm talking and moving in the first 10 minutes and really trying to make sure that they feel comfortable with me. So if you'd like to download my exact email template that I send to clients to prepare them for the engagement session, you can go to jamiedelainewatson.com slash engagement email, and that's where you can download that email template as my gift to you. And the link will be in the description below as well. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great week.